Jim, is this Texas? This is Texas Shell Pink. Texas. I know some great pond builders Come in Texas. In. So this is a little bit lighter than Emily oh, yeah, Grant yeah. Hutchings. This was actually a bee cross okay. um, by bee honey, cross honey bees. And this is a seedling of Emily Grant Hutchings. Mm. Uh, this one has cross between Emily Grant Hutchings and Woods White Knight. Stronger smell. So it's a, it's a much lighter pink, a much softer pink. That's why they call it a shell pink. Oh, right, on the inside like of a shell. Like a seashell. Yeah. Inside of a seashell. Seems like these ones are not quite as bronze as Emily. The new ones a are not. A little bit, little bit lighter. Yeah, because, a little bit lighter. Uh, and that corresponds with the color of the flower. Sure. Uh, this was uh, relatively recent, like in the mid 80s, 1980s. And Emily was the 20s, right? 27? Yeah, like okay. 22. I'm trying to remember these dates and these people that I don't know. This is good stuff. And this one, this one smells better to me. You haven't been smelling them. I haven't been. Smelling yeah, this them. one smells better to me than um, than Emily. But Emily smells great. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> I love that. What size pot is this one in? <clears throat> this one is in. An eight by five, so. A one gallon. Emily was, one gallon, was huge. But it, the flower was massive. Right. I mean, it was bigger than my hand. This one I can kind of, right? And yeah. that's corresponding to the, the pot, right? That's the what si we're The size about. of the pot. I mean, this one's cheating. It's got roots sit out far beyond the pot through okay. the holes, but still, the size pot has a lot to do with the size plant, the size flower, and the number of blooms. Okay. You want it bigger. Well, so, well, flower size, will this flower just get uh, as big as Emily? Because Emily's was, a, you know, it will. quite a bit bigger. It will. Okay. And it's early in the season, so Emily's will get quite a bit bigger than, than what you saw there. I mean, these can get you know, possibly up to 10 inches. in it. The flower 10 inches? Possibly up to 10 inches, and if, if it's a large enough plant. In a, in, a, in a 16 by 7? Probably in a 16 by 7. You might have to scooch the pot size up just a little, a little bit, more? bit more. Okay, that's what we want to know. So 16 by 7... Let's talk, let's talk size for just a minute because you have, what's the radius that this is going to, the diameter that we're going to get out of this if we go in a, in a one gallon? Let's give us an idea. Four feet? Uh, yeah, probably, f yeah, five feet, six feet. Five, six in a one gallon? Yeah. Okay, and then if we put it in a 16 by seven, you're what gonna, can we expect? You're going to get uh, eight feet to 10 feet. That is a big plant. Yeah. We need to build bigger ponds, right? <laughs> I like that. <laughs> you like that? We need, need more plants. I mean, so if, if you get eight, so if you go bigger, what are we looking at? If we're talking one plant. I mean, not, not all the little pups in right. coming up. One plant. One if, plant. So what would be the next size past the 16? Like when you go to the, the uh, big uh, botanical uh, gardens with big water lilies, what? Prob probably a, a 23 inch pot. 23 by what? 10. 23 by 23 10. By 10. Two, so two foot by one foot approximately, so everyone can remember easy. Two foot by one foot, and then it's going to get what, 12? You could get, 14? theoretically, a 12 to 14 foot spread. Off of one plant. On one plant. Dang. Yeah, big leaves, big flowers. Big leaves, big flowers. So, so this never is, leave it in the size pot <laughs> that it comes in. Never. We got we to get people to put them in bigger pots. Yeah. Because if people could see this in person... They wouldn't even hesitate to spend the extra money to get a bigger pot and some more soil. Okay, we didn't talk about price on these. Can we, are these $50 plants in one gallon or a little bit more? Uh, in the yeah, in the neighborhood of $50, $50 for a, a one okay. gallon. In a 16 by seven, they would probably be $100. Okay, let's not talk about, let's not talk about cultivator. You're a cultivator, you're like growing these and you're getting them for the industry and you're making right. money. Like that's, that's your job. Right. As, as like in your heart, which one do you want? Do you want the newer stuff or do you want the older stuff? Like do you want that 1922 plant or do you want that 1986 plant? You like them both, I'm sure. I want the plant that knocks my socks off. I don't, I don't really care what age it is. Okay. And, you know, Red Flare is an old plant. Are you wearing socks? <laughs> I'm wearing socks, look. <laughs> yeah, well, mine have been knocked off. <laughs> I'm not wearing socks. Oh, man, this is crazy. I'm wearing shorts next time we come here. I'm checking this out. I'm, we went through the, the reds. We went that deep red, and now we're into the pinks. We started with Emily Grant. She's still pretty pink, a little bit of white. Now we're into... 
uh, shell pink. Shell very pink. Light, very light. Progression pink. is to go to white. You have you have one more night bloomer, right? That yeah, we can we've, do. Yeah, we've got a very nice white. It's still daylight though. It is still daylight. What time is it? 9.30, 9.30. Okay, we barely have time to do the white. Who is she? Trudy Slocum. It's a she. Let's go do Trudy. Let's go check it out. Okay.